Hey guys, what's going on? Luke here back with a brand new video. In today's, I'm going to be buying a brand new pair of cleats. To do so, I'm going to one of the largest cities on earth, New York City. I'll see you there. I started off my cleat hunt at Adidas, one of the best soccer stores I've ever been to. The store is honestly amazing. Almost the whole first floor is dedicated to soccer stuff and they have tons of jerseys and all the new releases. It was great to see these boots up close and I took lots of pictures for Cleatstagram. They also had lots of the Euroball as well as the new Fracas which was just released for the finals. After checking out all the boots, I had one thing on my mind. Messi 16.1 Pure Agility. These things looked so good and that upper looked absolutely amazing. I tried the normal 16.1 variation, but I liked the pure agility a little better. I decided to try them on, although unfortunately they didn't fit my foot quite right and I couldn't pick them up. Don't worry though, I didn't leave the store empty handed. I picked up a blank jersey and got it customized with my Instagram account as well as 400 as I'm about to hit 400,000 followers. And I know what you're saying, Luke, you jumped the gun a little bit here, you've got 396k but I mainly did it as preparation, and I really like how it came out. Next up was Under Armour. This store, however, was a colossal disappointment. They had lots of shoes, but zero soccer stuff. I only had one shot left now, Nike Town, which required the use of the subway. Nike Towns for the most part have been very hit or miss for me. The Boston one's usually pretty bad. They never have anything in stock, and what they do have is usually old. However, this was definitely a hit. They had all the new releases from the Spark Brilliance pack, as well as Copa America and Euro jerseys. It was awesome. And now I'm going to let the boots do a little bit of the talking. After looking at all the shoes, there was definitely one that stood out to me, the Superfly 5. I had several pairs of Superfly 4s and thought they were awesome boots other than the sole plate cracking a few times. On this generation, Nike have switched the carbon fiber to P-backs and I really want to see how it performs. And I know, the Superfly is a pretty common cleat choice, but they're that popular for a reason. When I tried them on, they felt absolutely amazing and I had to pick them up. And there you go, that's the story of how these boots came to be my collection. I'm really excited to try them out and expect some test videos coming out soon. I hope you also enjoyed this video. It was a little different and spur of the moment, but I had loads of fun making it. If you have any suggestions for videos you'd like me to make, leave them down in the comments below. Thanks for watching guys, and briefly I want to say thank you so much for 5,000 subscribers. Your continued support means so much and I really do appreciate it. Thanks again guys, peace out.